So in this next tip, I'm going to show you how you can expand the memory of your Galaxy S6 Edge or S6. Let's take a look and see what's involved. So as you know, um, the S6 line of phones eliminated the expandable um, memory cards that most of us had with our S5s. So like me, um, many folks out there have extra one of these. This is actually a really small one that I have, but I actually have a 32 and a 64 gig uh, micro SD card that I have no use for now. I can't connect it into the phone. Now, one of the things that you can uh, consider uh, is a device like this that allows you to connect directly um, into your phone. Uh, the S6 has, um, and also like the S5, and I would say the Note 4, uh, many of the Samsung devices support something that's called OTG, and that's on-the-go USB. Uh, in other words, if I were to connect this device to the bottom of my phone, to that micro um, USB connector, um, it would read this uh, this reader and it would bring it up as a USB drive and I'm going to show you that in a second. Uh, this specific one from Psycho actually does um, the micro SD cards and also the standard uh, memory cards um, if you do have a standard memory card that you'd like to connect uh, right here. In this case I have it connected to this one. So here I can connect this USB to my computer or in this case since we're talking about the actual uh, phone I can connect this to the bottom of my S6 and it's going to read it as if it was a USB. So that's one option. Uh, the other option is to have a uh, another uh, memory card reader like this um, and this is um, also, I'll include the link uh, for this one on the YouTube channel. Let me get a little bit closer. You can see the actual uh, brand for it. So there you have it right there. And this was the memory card that I took out of my uh, S5. So this was a big one. Uh, this is a 32 gig uh, memory card. I'm sure that's in focus for you. Uh, that I am now, I have in this reader. So with this reader, I can actually plug it to the bottom of my S6 and read all the content that's on it or store files on it. So that's another option that you have. Uh, you also can get uh, one of these drives. Um, this is a micro USB drive from SanDisk. Sony has one of these as well. And what this allows you to do is to connect to your computer. This has actually 32 gigs of memory uh, on board. And then once you connect it to your computer, you can actually connect this to the bottom of your S6. And it will, again, read it, except in these two cases, we're actually reading micro SD cards. In this case, I'm just reading the uh, USB stick itself. So this is another option for you that you could consider. Now, if you have a lot of USB sticks like this and you'd like to use um, them for um, access, uh, for, for storage for your phone, one of the things that you could do is you can get a on-the-go a USB cable. And what this cable will do is um, you connect it to the bottom of your phone and once you connect it to the bottom of your phone, you can actually connect the USB stick to the actual um, USB port here and your phone would read it. Let me show you how all that works. So let me show you how OTG works. Um, I have uh, this specific reader. I've extended the actual micro USB connector and I'm going to plug it to the very bottom of the phone. Okay, so I'm going to plug that in. Once I snap it in, the phone will recognize it and you notice how it automatically opened up the drive. So here it's recognized it as a USB storage A. If I go back one step, you notice that I have um, what's local on my phone and now I have device storage which is what's on my device but you notice down here I have USB storage A. So if I go to it and I tap on it, this happens to be an image that is on my, uh, again, my USB stick uh, or that memory card, it's come up. So I can use my, again, this portable uh, USB to or reader to store music, to store movies, to store pictures, and you'll notice that it's reading it without any problems. If I go back, if I want to unmount it, because you want to unmount it, all you do is you swipe down, and you'll notice how it says uh, USB mass storage is connected. I'm going to choose this to unmount it, and in a second I should get a message that will tell me that it's uh, okay for me to unmount the storage. Let's take a look at see how one of the other devices works. So for the next one, I actually removed the cover uh, from the phone because this specific USB doesn't really have a long tip to it, and it kind of butts up to the actual cover itself. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take uh, this one from SanDisk, um, insert it. Make sure I get that in. All right, now that I have it connected, um, if I swipe from the top down, oh, it came up. Um, 
you would have seen that it recognized that I was connected to a USB device. Now I have, again, this device is connected, USB drive A, and you'll notice that I can see everything that's on this USB stick. So once again, uh, that's an option for you if um, you want to expand your storage. Now, the last one we're going to show you is how the OTG cable works. So now the last example is I have, again, my S6. I have the OTG cable connected. I'm just going to place it right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab a USB. I could use this USB. I can use this USB, even though this has a, a double connector. I could use any USB uh, and connect it to the actual phone. So I'm going to choose. I'll just connect this one since we've already done this once. And I'll plug it in here. So it's connected to this port right here. And now when I come over here, what should happen is just like uh, with earlier, um, the actual drive itself should come up. So now it's reading it from the specific cable. So you have several options to expand the memory for your S6. You could use a reader switch like this, and I'll include a link on the YouTube channel so that you can get something like this if you want to reuse your micro SD cards. Or one like this that's a little bit more portable. Uh, you could get an OTG cable. Right, um, and you know, there's even another option that uh, we didn't talk about. Uh, this one is from IO Gear that allows you to. It's a multi-card reader as well that you could use. So there are a lot of options for you to expand the memory for your S6 and S6 Edge. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any comments or questions, leave them on the YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.